Welcome back, everyone. I may seem enthusiastic. Why am I enthusiastic? This van is finally done. Yes, it's off to its home. Uh, next week's getting picked up, so we'll like shoot a video. Are we shooting a video of it? Maybe. We might shoot a video of it, put a video up of it. Um, yeah, but that's disappearing next week. So, what does that mean? That means moving on to probably one of the next projects that we have here. No, it means another project has turned up. You might have remembered this old thing. Uh, this was owned by David Clark several years ago. We done tubs and stuff on it. Uh, probably about what five years ago now. Four. Probably four or five years ago now. We done all the old uh, tub work on this and tubbed into the doors. Um, like tubs on the rear and stuff to get some extra loads out of it. Again, it's already on hydraulics. This is now owned by Jamie Galia. Galia? I still don't know how to pronounce the name. Sorry, Jay. Galia? Uh, Galia? No, just Galia. Galia. Is it Galia? Oh, sorry. Anyway, uh, you would have seen previous videos of Jay's, of his T4 that was on the channel. Actually, there's two uh, videos of the T4. There's a blue one with the big low down circle logo on the back. Uh, he also got rid of that. Had a little phase with cars, but he's, you know, come to his senses now. So, he bought this off David. Um, no, he didn't. He bought this off the guy who bought it from David. Anyway, so this is running a 2.2 litre Subaru Lump, is it? Something like that? Subaru Lump. Um, we're going to body drop it. It's not going to be anything like Miles' high top, because that job escalated massively. Originally, that was in for just a body drop, but we've done loads of work on that, so it's here for a very long time. All we've got to do is the bare essentials, just the metal work on this, cut it out, raise everything, weld it all back in, and then it's back off to Jay um, to finish doing all the other stuff that he wants to do. So we're going to do a build series on this just because it should, in theory, be quite quick. We're hoping within the month. Um, so, like, yeah, four weeks, so maybe we get about four episodes out of it. Jay's not um, Jay's not answering. Is that Jay Galia or Jay Gala? Yeah, I don't know which one it is. Gala? How's it spelled? G-A-L-Y-E-R. So it's Galia. Ah, I'm forgetting it. Yeah, so today we're just going to have a strip down. Um, yeah, get all the internal panels out. Uh, get the, no, it might be on the phone. Get the floor out. Um, door cards off bed out, all that sort of stuff that's in the wire, the metal work seats out. Um, yeah, so that next week we can get cut and um, start getting this shit raised up. The grey one was three years. The grey one was three years? The yeah, grey one was three years, this one's going to be three weeks. We don't typically work on things for three years. Uh, we didn't work on that for three years either. I would say we probably did what? Actually about two months worth of work on it, probably about eight months, eight weeks worth of work on it in reality, um, it's just spread over a very long period of time, there was very much, bearing in mind that is body dropping it, narrowing the whole front end, repair panels on the outside, full paint, full interior, all that sort of shit. Bench seat, painted dash, yeah, it's, most, it's mostly a full build, um, kind of, so yeah, it's very pretty. Oh, we just need to put that little, last little bit of black graphics. What did I tell you about the ET thing? Oh, there. Sorry. <laughs> ET photo. Um, yeah, it's very cool. I'll give you a quick, quick little snippet. Yeah, you can see all the tartan trimming there. Ooh. The tartan trimming here. Yeah, very nice. Yes. So, let's get on with it. Um, new wheels for the West Bus. Uh, I'm sure by the time this video goes live, you would have seen those wheels on the West Bus, but who knows? Um, right, let's get into it. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> things have escalated a bit quickly. Um, I've had a haircut. Handsome. Um, 
So we got on stripping this. It was a bit of a ball like the old floor was probably stuck down, a bed out, seats out, um, like all rubbers and stuff like that. So we started getting on with that. Um, but tomorrow morning, which is when I shall next pick you up, um, I am heading down to Southampton uh, to the Brookspeed event. Um, this is something that some of the members in Lowdown have actually put on with Brookspeed. Um, we actually haven't had any involvement in it whatsoever. We can't take any credit for it. Um, like I said, it's like a couple of members have basically um, rallied together and put on a meet. So we're going to shoot down there. Um, I've got like a few goodie bags because um, I think there's some awards and stuff on Sunday. Um, yeah, we will shoot down there. Put the new wheels on the West Bus. So you shall probably see them in one of the next shots. Um, so, yes, good night. And in a minute, hey, good morning. Right, let's get ourselves on the road. So, just stopped off at Auto Finesse on the way down, grab some bits for the awards. Um, I've also just noticed that it's going to be well windy this weekend and I've forgotten the fluffy things for the microphone, so the audio might be terrible throughout this video. Um, yeah, there's some familiar faces here. Obviously, Gareth Fan over there. Uh, the Auto Finesse 661 that we bagged. Put the bags on the back of this to tow the airstream. There's the bay window that we've done the roof rack on. The roof rack, that's patina and up nicely. Huh? Crusty boy. Oof. Lovely. time but made it to Brook Speed portion performance. So come back. So I imagine this is just the group of everyone for tonight. I don't know how many people are coming tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'll do a quick little walk around, film some stuff and then um, I have a couple of beers.
Um, thanks to guys at Brookspeed, um, also Robin and Jay. I had no involvement with this club whatsoever. Um, those guys set it up on their own backs as club members to actually put something on. Um, so yeah, thanks to all those guys. Um, right, we'll sort it out. Well, the guys have sorted out three awards. Um, I stopped all the finesse and grabbed some like detail and bags. I see a bit in it. There's some um, out of socks and stuff in there. The best of the show winner. Can they see the guys have got their big food t in the corner? Because they're going to give a hoodie to the best of the show person as well. Um, so, without further ado, we've got most committed, which I thought was a weird. <laughs> go with it anyway. Um, most committed was. Shit, what was it? Uh, oh, it's Martin. With the bay window in the corner. <laughs> Good. Jay to just film the awards and camera battery died. I didn't think I had to charge it with me, but I did. Um, anyway, so yeah, great weekend down at Brookspeed. So thanks to the guys at Brookspeed for letting us use their yard and putting that event on. Um, it's a really cool place. Again, I sort of mentioned it in the prize given, but we had no real involvement with that at all. Um, that was literally put on by the members, um, Jay and Robin. Uh, so a massive shout out to those guys for organising that for everyone. Um, that's a nice thing to do for the club side of things. Uh, another shout out to Auto Finesse for giving us some goodie bags for the award winners. Um, Monster Wraps for wrapping the skateboards and Bus Envy, Bo Air Bus Envy Boutique for um, like hoodie for the best in show. Uh, yeah, it was a great weekend. Um, nice to just get out. Um, we'll try and do another couple of things this year at some point. Um, we're actually looking to do something here at the end of summer, possibly. Um, the backyard, which is behind us, which is hidden, is now getting tarmacked, I think. Um, and it's quite a sizable yard. So that might free us up to actually do something here. We've always been a bit restricted because we're on, like, road. And next door to us is... Hermes parcel delivery company and then screw fix next door to that so it is fairly busy still here on the weekends um, and we're kind of in the centre of a town as well so it might attract unwanted attention um, so yeah there may be something going on here later on in the year I don't know yet um, obviously keep your eyes peeled uh, Westbus performed faultlessly obviously good man um, wheels went down well the new rotor form PMS, I think they're called. It's really bad considering we're going to be selling them. Um, if you're interested in them, they'll be dropping soon, I believe. Um, they're the first set that are in the UK. There should be more to follow at some point soon. Um, this is actually the, a whole week later. <laughs> so bad I am at doing this job. Um, but I've had a busy week. Uh, I've just bagged uh, this 
Free place left T5 on solo air with Navis extender splits. So there'll be some pictures of that on our Instagram pretty soon. Um, I'm now it's Saturday, I'm now getting on with this one because this is supposed to be done by Tuesday. So again, bagging that one, second hand kit, it's all ABP and stuff. So yeah, it's all busy. Um, the T25 high top has gone. Um, finally, that got picked up. That was like a last minute rush trying to get that finished this week. Um, I don't think we did any filming on it, which is a shame. Um, yeah, should have got some more content out of that, but I think there will, there'll be plenty of pictures of it coming soon. Um, and I'm sure you'll see more of it on the internet. Like I said, that's going to be raffled off through Aspire competitions at some point. So grab some tickets for that because it'd be good if someone who's into low stuff wins that van. Um, because yeah, it's a cool body drop van. Uh, other questions that we got asked the weekend, like merch. Um, obviously, there's not a lot of merch going on on the website at the minute. We're currently working on that. As I said, we've been really busy here at the minute. It's been a massive influx of work. We need to clear the back room so we can get back to the printing room um, and work on like a spring summer collection. So that will probably be end of April, middle of May, maybe. Um, we'll do a big drop. But again, subscribe to our email and list if you can. Go onto the website and just click subscribe to that and you'll obviously get notifications for that sort of stuff. Um, green T25 is what we're on to next uh, I think I've got the next couple of weeks on that Jack's just got to finish his caddy off and then we're both on that for a couple of weeks I believe so should be a quick body drop hopefully um, there'll be plenty of videos on that so please like this video if you did like it subscribe to the channel um, it helps us out massively if you all subscribe and you'll get notifications when we post up videos of that sort of stuff and any more stuff. But yes, good weekend away. Hopefully I've covered everything in this outro so Jack doesn't tell me off. Um, yeah, catch you on the next one, guys. Thanks for watching. Oh, also, everybody kept asking me about the split screen, where it is, why I'm not using it. Um, it obviously had a long use last year drove it obviously all the way up for Christmas because I was doing the West bus so that is still just sat in the back room patiently awaiting some work to be done to it so we're just trying to clear our way to it basically um, trying to get some of these things out of the way and then because I need to get on the ramp to do bits wheels are all split apart um, places are all there lips and barrels are all there because I need to polish all the lips and barrels and I'm going to get the wheel faces refurbed um let me know what color you should think i should do the wheel faces in the comments below um i'm thinking like some sort of these caddy rods are nice like some sort of matte i know dark gray or brown or bronze or gold or something so yeah hopefully the plan is maybe end of next week once these a few of these are gone i'll pull that through and that can live here so that i can get it back on and off the ramp as I need to and get that sorted um, and try to get that back on the road. So hopefully that answers that for you. Right, this actually is the end of the video now. Goodbye.